This video is about how to determine which elements in your system are loaded under pressure and which are loaded under tension. It will be in particular important by the problems where you have to dimension the elements in your structure with steel profiles since the elements that are loaded under pressure require you to also consider their stability in buckling. In order to distinguish between pressure and tension we will use two colored pencils. Blue stands for pressure red for tension. It is not important where do you begin, but just for clarity I'm going to show the procedure on this element running between the spaces A and 4. Pick one end point and rotate around it from one space to another in the clockwise direction. In this case we are moving from space A to space 4. Now look at the force diagram and also move from point A to point 4. Copy the direction to the form diagram and mark it by the endpoint. Do the same by the other endpoint. Now we are moving from point 4 to point A. Mark the arrow in the form diagram. Now we see that these two arrows are pointing against each other. That's right. And it means that both of these points are pulled against each other. In other words, this element is under tension. I'm going to mark it red. Now let's look at another element running between spaces 4 and 5. Pick this endpoint and rotate around it in the clockwise direction from space 4 to 5. Now in the force diagram move from point 4 to 5. In form diagram mark the arrow by the endpoint. Now let's do the same by the other endpoint. Rotate in the clockwise direction from space 5 to space 4. In the force diagram move from point 5 to point 4. And in the form diagram again mark the arrow by the endpoint. In this case, the two points are being pushed away from each other. In other words, this element is under pressure. If you get something like this, it means your element is under pressure. If you get something like this, your element is under tension. That's it. I hope you got it. Comment below if you have any questions. Thank you for watching.